All right, we're back. It was a decent break. Did some stretches, got some water, walked around for a minute. Apparently I'm continuing to burp. I went to Red Robin earlier, uh, the hamburger uh, chain. And I, I eat there way too often, man. I get the Royal Red Robin. It's like a, it's basically a bacon cheeseburger with a fried egg on it. And man, that's my jam. Anything with egg on it is usually my jam. Kill actual enemies that are my level. But now I do way more damage, which I forgot about. Because I got the damage upgrade as well as the new weapon. You know, even some defense. Still not worth it to do that, but I don't really. Go to the left, see what what happens. Cause yeah, I just don't see the probe. But maybe this is the end of it? Oh. Oh we we made it to La Bergen. After that long climb, I'm sure wouldn't mind a break in one of those cozy houses. The next dungeon should be close by. I hope they let you enter without a huge load of exposition. Oh. Uh, I would love to explore this, but that means that we can find the, uh... Or wait. Does that mean it's... So is the probe in the Bergen Trail? What am I doing? I'm in a cave on the Bergen Trail. Okay. So it is here somewhere. You guys think it's here? No. It's on four. Oh, something's down there, too. Alright. So it's down here. The map seems to suggest that it's in the middle, but it seems kind of weird. Oops. Okay. How am I, uh... How am I getting out of here? I'm not, is the answer, I think. Oh, nope, I can jump up. That's weird. I, I don't get the difference sometimes. Oh, shit. Not the worst. I just don't necessarily want to aggro those guys. was a cave, where would I be? I'd be right there. Ah. 
Is there like a switch I would have to open? Why is it closed? This is going to consume my life. But... Do I have to kill all the enemies? I will. Third enemies respawn, goddammit. Is this just, is it something I can't do? I mean, I guess I'll... Can I go... I'll go to the right, Let's see what's popping. Probably the way you actually get up to that building. Or even really up there in any capacity. Approach it from the other, other way.
So there's something in here. Chest. Beta plume bush analyzed. Like that that's a cave. Okay, how do we get there? It's not high enough. Aha. Then we would run to this. Then we would run to that. Then we would run to this. We can't do anything with that. Uh, set a stamp. Chest. Okay, great. Are you... <laughs> Whatever, we can't get in either cave. I don't understand. How do we get over there? I'm getting over the Bergen Waterfalls. Let's go. We have one more cave chance. It looks like there's a small thing off to the side there. I don't get why they would give you that quest if it was in some fucking unobtainable area. Exit to the left. That's taller than I am. These stupid rabbits, why are they just popping out?
Okay. We're getting somewhere. It's time. really blown it. There's a cave here too? Well, whatever, man. Let's talk to this chick about her stupid rabbit. Now, let me look at this botanical bullshit. All right. Okay, so I think that means that we if they have the drop rates, it means we did it. So I gotta find more Omega Ball plants in the first area, but I have not seen them. You're back, and just in time, too. I found a device, capture device. Yeah, it was super expensive, but it's totally worth it. Did you get the frosted carrots? Very nice. Now, we only have to capture this legendary bunny, or whatever people call it. From what I understood, the guys I got my info from said that you'd have to bring the frosted carrots to Windy Climb. As I said, it's a part of Bergen Trail. Turns out it was the same part I was attacked in, right? Which means we just have to get the frosted carrots to that place. The guys said just having the capture device and defeating the monster would capture it. So here we go, take the device. What, do you think I would go up there again? Never, ever. Come on, you got the carrots too. I'm not really a fighter. It's not because I'm scared or whatever. Thanks, I know you can do it, but prepare yourself. The creature might be super strong. Oh boy, looks like you found the place where the legendary bunny is. Be careful, who knows how strong this enemy is. So what do you want to do? I'm not sure if... Never mind. Now's your chance, Lee. This was just a normal young frobbit. Wow, you seem exhausted. Wait, does that mean you captured it? Oh my gosh, really? I bet it was super hard to beat, right? 
thanks so much, Leek. Can I have it? Wow, kind of looks like a normal young Frobbit, don't you think? I thought it would have dark red eyes and bloody fur or something. Well, that matters as you captured it, right? Alright, alright. You did it. Again, thank you so much. I have to log off and show this to my friends. They won't believe it. A live legendary monster in my inventory. Super awesome. Here, take this as a reward. Bye, Lee. Hope to speak to you soon. What? That was like the most disappointing quest ever. I don't know how to get that goddamn data probe. They're gonna have to unlock the ability to do ice or, uh... Something else. Oh, to get through the blue stuff, I guess. To become a true avatar, you first need to master all four elements. The first element, heat, lies ahead in the temple mine. Prepare. It will test your wits before granting you new powers. Oh, heat. Nice. I like that. Okay, well, the heat will make it so that I can break the other things. Ugh, this guy's blocking the storage house again. I wish he would meditate somewhere else under a waterfall or whatever. Oh, I could just walk there and been able to teleport here. That's whatever. Not that big a deal. Hey, girl, what can I get you? Hi, ain't no drink I know about. Jeez. Darn mine, ancients, blah 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 blah. Oh, hey, Seeker. Hi. You see that house over there? The townsfolk are pretty quiet about it, but something very strange is going on over there. Some nights I swear I see light coming out of the cracks, even though the house has been abandoned for years. Very strange. It's a small house doing on the side of the river. It must be really inconvenient to live here, having to jump over the waterfall every day. up high in the windy climb. Hidden is a patch. Only for a telepath. Okay, a riddle maybe? Hmm. know what that means. There's like some hidden path. are gonna drive me nuts. I don't know what to... Ugh. Right, well, what do you have here? Another seeker, eh? Got a lot of your kind marching into Bergen with the first station of tr the track being here. Many of you even offer some assistance to us being all do-goody and well-intentioned, I suppose, but can just anyone with a fancy title do real police work and face the worst of humanity? I doubt it. You want to prove me wrong, eh? All right, then I got a, simp a nice and simple practice for you. A goat kid is jumping around the roofs of Bergen Village, annoying the citizens so to you catch him. Find goat kid. Sure. Okay, then, I want you to take care of this dwarf goat that is annoying the good citizens of Bergen. 
Yes, yes, catching it might sound simple, but it's really quick and likes to climb to higher places. It's stealing food, shiny stuff, and everyone's time, and I don't want to waste our manpower on it. Besides, it does sound like ideal seeker work, eh? So you better show me your worth. That's a spirit. You should be able to find it somewhere on the rooftops of Bergen. Happy climbing! Sweet lemon juice, baby. Okay, over here. Oh, Bergen North. Oh, dang, how do I get in that building? Like a secret building? How the fuck? What? Hey there, do you like Mr. Cotton Snow here? How nice of you. It took me a while to get him the perfect hat, but it just looks so precious on him. Hello, player, and welcome to the Omni Guilders. We are a guild of traders who try to extend their reach through offering players simple quests, and I'm a humble general, kind of a manager for the guild. Yes, yes. Might interest you in said quests? Well nodded. Here we go. One of the Omni Guilders has asked you to obtain some materials for their base. You will find them in the Temple Mine and on Bergen Trail. I have not seen any of those other than Rock Beak, I guess. And as we transferred here as soon as you find them. Sorry, but I can't let you go through here. Okay, that seems dumb as shit. But sure. Mm, that's the bank.
First dungeon is just ahead. Just stay calm. Remember the basics and you should be fine. I guess they still have been fighting in groups until now. It's a bit of a change. Hi. Oh, hey there. Are you also on your way to try the first dungeon? It's not that hard, but a lot of new players are scared of it, especially if you gotta... because you gotta do it on your own. Yeah, I was confused about that as well. The puzzles are a core element to those temple dungeons, and they wouldn't really work in groups of random sizes, so it makes sense to restrict them to solo instances. You gotta prove your own skills to progress the story. Alright, alright. But you better not complain if it take forever to beat it then. Don't worry. I'll even stick around if you need moral support or calming words via direct link. Gee, thanks. Hi, ah, Seeker, it is a pleasure seeing more of your kind here in Bergen. I am Mrs. Summers, holding the position of chairperson in Bergen Trade and Metalwork. Lovely. Alas, we should not spend too much time on idle pleasantries. After all, we business people have much a responsibility to humanity's progress as any soldier. Sadly, some of those among us are more concerned with personal vanities nowadays, but appeasing even associates such as those falls onto me, as useless as it might seem. You, on the other hand, like a diligent young lady, could I ask you to lighten my burden a bit? It's your help and search for a top hat where these are fine taste. Excellent. Operation Trackwalker truly shows its worth all facets of our society. The person in question is called Jamie Twirlson. You should find him in the local item shop. He wastes his time and patience of all his colleagues with fruitless fashion experiments. Hopefully you can be of some assistance to him so that he can finally work towards something more worthwhile. It's so weird because you can craft all this shit, but I don't, I don't know if it's actually worth it to do. He's going to want this perforated top hat. No, this just won't do. What is it? Can't you see that I am a fragile, a fragile icy cage of emotions? Ah, the council has sent you to assist me. Finally, they have recognized the importance of my quest. And you also seem to be a person of refined taste. An unexpected sight, indeed. You see, I have devoted my life to the search for... The perfect hat. Fit only for the noblest of pates. Thus, when tales of a legendary piece of headwear called the Top Hat reached me, I had to settle down here. But so far, the only ones I've seen were the ruined pieces of rag worn by those terrible snow creatures. The sacred art of the Top Hat cannot be entirely lost. Someone in Bergen must still be skilled in it. Finding the Lost Master is now up to you, a worthy task indeed. Find a skilled hat maker. Uh, I actually, I didn't realize how much this was covering up the, uh, the characters there, so I'll move it up. Alright, skilled, skilled top hat, man. Sure. Sure.
It's weird that it, I mean, also kind of cool that there are all these guilds. Welcome to our humble monastery, Seeker. This one's name is Nema, and I am the spiritual guide for our order. Know that many souls that desire understanding of the track seek our guidance, Seekers chief among them. We must, however, test their mental balance and physical aptitude to deem them worthy of our allegiance. What about you, young Seeker? Do you desire to be tested? You've talked to the monks and ascension the spirits in Bergen to prove your harmonic connection with the track. Beating a trial shall be necessary. No modifiers are active during the trial. I felt that you would answer as much. The track resonates strongly inside you. Go to Monk Hasok to start the first trial. You can find him under this very roof. Greetings, young one. I sense that our wise leader has sent you to me for a test of your inner balance. Very well, but it is not I who will test you, but the very track itself. For that purpose, we prepared a trial that works in harmony with the track deep within these mountains. Enter this teleporter to reach the start of your trial. To show your worth, reach the other side and return with the sacred artifact found there. Oh, an instance? I want to do the quest together with you. Oh, shit. Fuck. Okay, well... Okay, I'm doing very bad. Circle is shield. Wonder if that'll actually help. Peace. Oh, fuck. Okay. Fucking dumb trial. Patience. Shh. Oh, I actually have to pay attention. This is rough. We haven't had, like, a real puzzle slash trial thing in a long time. Oh shit, I- oh boy. I was just looking for the exit. These kinds of puzzles are going to be my undoing, I think. Like, what? Circle is guard, Manny. Circle is guard. Alright, now I'm just getting... Now I'm just rushing.
Wait, what? I just fell off? Huh? Inspiration proof. Ah, you have returned. Indeed, the firm aura that surrounds you speaks of your success. Also, the blessed trinket you returned leaves no room for doubt. Very good. You should now return to the wise to complete the initiation. Ah, it is you again. Truly, I can feel change inside you. Yes, what was once mere embers among dry leaves has become a fire that may one day shed light into the darkest of corners. And I presume you desire our guidance and the wisdom you came for. But you see, by challenging yourself and beating our trial, you've already grown so much. Yes, leading you to find your determination and inner strength, that was our true guidance. Now, young seeker, take some refreshment Go forth and bring balance wherever you go. Okay, sure. Alright, there's multiple points of exit. But we are trying to... This fucking goat to go away. Oh, hello. Can I help you, or do you just want to admire the handsome image of coolness here? Nods at hat. Ah, you want to know about this hat of his? Yeah, I made it myself. I can make you one as well, if you want, but the materials I need are really tricky to get. Especially the old hats. You can get them from his mean brothers in Bergen Trail. But you'll need to defeat them with style, otherwise those fancy hats will just mysteriously disappear. Well, good luck with that. I look forward to making more of those. What? I need Winter Thorn. So that'll just happen naturally. No one at the inn needed anything. Ow. Two buildings that I can't really get into. I just don't get what the f What is that building? It's in between the two, but it's right on the edge. What the f Like, I get- that's this one, alright? Yeah, that's this one. What the hell's the other one? I don't understand.
Interesting. Stone of Valor. What's in here? Nothing? Nothing. that to get anywhere else. Okay. I see how to get to the other one. I don't. Go. What the fuck is happening? How do I... How do I do it? I don't get this one. Oh, how do I get up there? This fucking go. Dear Seeker, you seem rather confused. Do you wish to pass the barrier? In that case, you'll need to obtain the blue ice shade. It is given to anyone who completes the temple mine. Okay. And that means that I can do get more melee attack as well. Because that's what you need to get the other... Thing. I gotta be missing something here, man. Because what... I feel like I'm going out of my mind. I've been playing this for like three hours straight, so maybe I am, but what?
I will figure this out. I will get this goat, and it will be magnificent. Now I don't even know how to get over there. Okay, I can do that, but I'm getting this first. Bug shell, I think I needed that for something. <laughs> Can I make that jump? It like if I end up making this jump I'm gonna get so angry. Well, I guess I would have to get there first, wouldn't I? I should be able to fucking make that jump. I should be able to. Why can't I make that jump? It's my undoing. How the fuck? What are these? What are these, like, weird lightning rods? Fuck. <laughs> I'll try for a couple more minutes and then I'll, uh... Then I'll give it up.
homies, like, tell me how to get up there, my boys. Come on. It should be over here. I should just be able to make this goddamn jump. Oh, he's got another quest? Hell yeah. Seeker, you may have proven your worth, but I feel you still have some room for refinement. You have beaten the first trial, but that does not mean you have mastered it. For this very purpose, we have prepared some additional challenges in the Cave of Aspiration. No shield challenge. Dude, I am not about that. I am not about that. I just fucked up this. I don't know. Fuck that, man. Where the hell are the frobbits? I don't even... Where... Where are you, man? Oh, wait, where is he? He's in Bergen Village. Where's the Bergen Digging Mates house? The fuck is that? Is it... Is this hard? Missing some fucking fundamental thing. And even then, you can't fucking. All right. It's right here. A visitor fresh from the outside, eh? No need to reply. Feel the sun's warmth still on you, child. Har, that looks on your face. The name's tourist McEden Thill, chief miner of the Bergen Digging Mates. Welcome to your humble headquarters. Don't worry, the icy mine might have cooled our manners, but we don't feast on the warm blood of the living just yet. Still, the mines have become rather possessive and demand our full attention these days. Some strong hands that can help clean up a mess on the surface would be most welcome. There's been some incursion of some thrice darned hopping fur balls in one of our most active mining areas. These pesky things got contaminated by the ores and machinery inside, and now they're running wild in Bergen Trail. What's worse, for some damn reason, the filthy fur made them angry as drunk bovines and almost impossible to kill. Just my thoughts. Care to help us get rid of that mess before we get the blame for whatever shins they kick? 
If Robots broke into the mine or contaminated before fleeing, weaken them with the forced baths and defeat them. Go to Rising Path 2 and look for dirty Frobbits. Finally, some good news. Now, I guess I better tell you how to get rid of those indestructible pests, eh? It's rather simple. Their fur is hardened by whatever dirt got stuck in it. So all they need is a good bath. Don't worry, there's no need to hunt them with a sponge and bucket. Just give them a good shove into the nearest lake and then hammer their freshly bathed butts into the ground. Good, you better get going. I'll give you the location. Bergen digging aids. Okay, great. Greeting seeker, you desire to enter the mine, am I not mistaken? Unfortunately, you will need to f receive the mine pass. Do not fret, it is easily obtained. Simply attend the mayor's orientation and heed his story. You can find him in the quest hub, the grand building in the north of Bergen. Seeker hub, I see. Uh, all right, just let's path the rising path two. Okay. So just go up to and kill some frobates. You guys are not the dirty frobbits at grave. I don't know where your fucking probe is, man. Making me angry. at all these dirty frobbits. Oh, there's a fucking filthy frobbit. How do you get over there?
All right, we did it. Yeah, one more winter thorn. Where am I getting that? ones give the thorn. And how the fuck do I get up there? Now I'm getting frustrated. I can't 100% it anymore. I'm missing all kinds of shit. I was talking about a trail to the north on this 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 area. It's like something like only telepaths would see. We did, did blah, 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 blah. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm getting distracted. Let me just go to the damn the damn trial. Alright. trying to get into the bathroom, which is stupid because he closed the door on himself. Yeah, I heard him hit the door and go in. So he's a freaking weirdo. 
great. You really helped us out here. We would have fallen behind with our mining operation otherwise. Here, take our reward fresh from the mines. Dang, Metal Gear? Alright, we gotta go listen to whatever the fuck the mayor's gotta say. The ability for this lock chests man all right let's check it out exposition dear seekers welcome to bergen as the mayor of this town it always honors me to see so many visitors arriving day after day of course that's because this town's mine has become a part of the ancient's track now since some of you look rather confused allow me to quickly explain it all happened several years ago. Bergen was founded due to mining activities in this area. After some time, we discovered a temple of the ancients hidden inside the mountain right at our mining location. At that time, we saw it merely as an obstacle, so we continued our mining endeavor, destroying the temple in the process. That was until the, stra the track started to fight back. After a series of attacks, we were forced to give up the mine. With the mine conquered by the track, it started to reconstruct the temple based on its own infrastructure. And that's how the temple mine was born. Now, why do I tell you all of this? Bergen supports Project Trackwalker, so of course we will give you access to the mine. However, we plan to get back into the mining business. When we lost the mine, we also lost equipment and technical documentation still hidden inside. All we ask is for you to recover those things as you traverse a temple mine. For more information, please consult the advisors on the ground floor. With that being said, I'll now gladly give you the pass to the temple mine. Thank you very much for your attention, and good luck on your journey. No respect for the ancient holy grounds, yada yada. Certainly heard that one before. Greeting Seeker, you just heard the mayor's speech, am I correct? Good, as you mentioned, more important tools abandoned in the mine are still lost inside it. It would be a great help to the entire town if someone could retrieve them for us. Can we count on your help, Seeker? I mean, I think I have to. Very good. There are three types of equipment missing, laser pickaxe, laser TNT, and mining docks. You should be able to find all these somewhere within the temple mine. Since the equipment might be difficult to spot, we hand our detectors to support your search. You can retrieve the detector from my colleague over there. Stay vigilant. Greeting Seeker, I see you accepted the task of collecting the temple mine equipment. Please take this detector to aid your search. This detector will notify you when there is current equipment or lost equipment in the current room. Good luck with the search. Shift tutorial. You can find your add-ons in the last tab inside the inventory. Simply click the add-on to enable or disable it. No. Interesting. Now there will be add-ons that we're gonna get, huh? Ooh, it's a D-Link request by Lucas. Holero, you two. Bonjour, Monsieur Dark Lord. Oh, I see you're in a party right now. That's just perfect. I'm here to cordially invite you to the headquarters of the First Scholars. First what? The First Scholars. That's my guild. I told the chief about you two, and she said we could use a couple new members. Really? Are you saying we can already join a guild? Jap, at least never heard of any rule against it. Trogren genial! Of course, the folks would like to meet you first, so if you're not busy right now, why don't you quickly drop by? Absolutely. We should totally go, Lee. Great, let's meet in Autumn's Rise at the Old Obelisk. That's a landmark. You two just quickly teleport there, remember? Bon sir! Alright, until then! A guild, Lee, will join a guild! Isn't that awesome? Come on, better not make the Dark Lord wait too long! A guild, huh? Hmm. You'll meet lots of players. I have to admit, I am a bit concerned. You remember that we must keep your amnesia a secret, right? Well, I suppose you can't tell anybody about it anyway, correct? In that regard, your speech malfunction turns out to be quite useful. So as they say, just go for it. Come on, Lee! Wait, I wanted to do the Dungeone! Can we not now? Greeting Seeker. 
I see you acquired the mine pass. Allow me to lower the barrier for you. But before we go into the mines, a warning. Some monsters inside may weaken you by causing chill or burn. Should that happen, drinking water will help you recover. Here, take some. Please stay prepared. Okay. No! I can't wait to enter the dungeon, but first you pay Luca. Luca's just waiting. Damn. Friggin' Lucas. Bonjour, Lucas. There you are. Thanks for dropping by. Let's go straight to the headquarters. It's to the northeast. Just follow me. Entrance is over there to the north. Here we are! Now this is the entrance to a small and humble guild area. You'll need a pass to enter, so here you go. This item gives you access to our headquarters as well. Now then, let's go! Oh, it's like a small village. Almost there. Here we are, the headquarters of the first scholars. Oh, it's a cute little house. Told you, we're a small guild, right? Well then, ladies first. Merci beaucoup. Ah, the newbies have arrived. This fellow here is Buggy. Bonjour, Emilie. Lee. Nice to meet you two. Lucas, Lucas. Bringing in the girls as usual, huh? Yeah, ha, ha. Sure, whatever. The others are waiting upstairs. As usual, don't take him seriously. Lynn, the newbies are here. Now, now, Raphael, don't call them newbies. It's rude. Come on, Chief, you know I'm joking. My, look at you two. Welcome to our humble headquarters. My nickname is Lynn but you can just call me Linda or Lynn. What? Those are three very disparate things. And this is Albert. Yo, Albert looks sick. Good day, pleased to meet you. Bonjour, I'm Emilie. Hi, Lee. A pentafist and a spheromancer. Oh, how wonderful. If you two joined our guild, we'd have members of all five classes. Ah, but I'm getting ahead of myself. Let's go somewhere comfortable. Such a cozy little house. Nothing like I had imagined it. Thank you so much. It's like the house I always wanted to own. Now, of course, it's not the fortress that many people expect, but really the few of us wouldn't know what to do with all the space, eh? Jap, also, it's not like we could afford the castle of our dreams. Yes, yes. So, there's just four members right now? Not quite, dear. Someone else joined us not too long ago, but he isn't around at the moment, so that makes five members in total. One, two... Okay. And you two just started playing, right? We, we just reached Bergen and we're about to enter the mine. Ah, wonderful, the first real dungeon. It's always something special. It's the first time you'll be entering a heritage site of the ancients. Oh, what's that? Why, it's what we seekers are looking for. We try to solve the secret of the ancients, eh? Such heritage site includes a few pieces of the big puzzle. We oui, we oui, the plot. That's right, dear. Did you know that the full secret of the ancients is yet to be discovered? Really? Oh yes, they're so crafty about it. The official path of the game will only tell you so much. They keep releasing new quests that will reward you with more information. But the puzzle is yet to be completed. And yes, this is what our guild is all about. We are the first scholars and we study the ancients. And we want to be the first to unravel the secret. I see. And now you understand why our guild is so small. <laughs> Hush, Raphael. Well, I think it's nice to be in a small guild like this. There's just too much stress and responsibility with the big ones. I think it's nice, right, Lee? Lee, my dear, you've been so quiet all this time. Is something the matter? Oh, she's just shy. Anyway, I'd be glad to join. You too, Lee. So, where do we sign? Now, now, we have a small tradition here for new members. A quiz. A quiz? Oh, don't worry. It's very simple. We want to test your knowledge of the ancients. 
But for that, I'm afraid I first need you to complete the Temple Mine in Bergen. Just make sure to read everything at the Heritage site and you should be well prepared. D'accord, sounds good to me. Come on, Lee, let's go to the dungeon! That's the spirit. It's a pleasure to meet you two. Feel free to drop by whenever you like. Oh, and I suppose now's a good time to share context, too. Context shared with first scholar members. Alrighty, tell me when you're ready for the quiz. Learn how to contact the players of Crossroads. You find contacts on your second tab. You can contact those players and have a small chat as long as they're online. Whoa, they're what level are they? 56, 70, Beowulf is 75? Holy crap! So you two are determined to enter the dungeon together? You bet we are. You are aware the dungeons are incense, right? You have to beat it by yourselves. We, oui, we, oui, we know. But we enter at the same time and do a race on who competes the dungeon first. Just like with Rhombus Dungeon, I was first that time. Well, to be honest, it was very close. Oh, Jung, you're quite the competitive pair. Hello, my dears. Please make yourself at home and let me know if you need anything. Lynn, I was wondering, are you the leader of this guild? Well, yes, you could say that. I started this guild together with Al, but we're all pretty much family at this point. It sure feels like visiting a family house with so many grown-up children. Why, yes, we all just stayed young at heart. Life is too short to be all serious business, eh? We. Oui. Good day, you two. Pardon, your name was Albert, huh? That is correct. Uh, may I ask what your class is? That would be Hexacast. Ah, uh, that's the mage class, no? I don't know why, but you don't quite strike me as a mage, monsieur. That's fine, I get that a lot. Is that so? Well then, good luck with the temple mine. This guy's kind of hard to talk to, no? Hey there, newbies. Just wait until we reach your level, monsieur. I'll make you regret calling us newbies, you'll see. Ha, you sound like my little brother planning to catch up with my age. Nya, ha, ha. Wee wee, laugh while you still can. He looks kind of like that weird little green dude that my Sphere Mancer rival there, so I bet that's his brother. Mm, haven't saved in a long time, might as well. Hello there. Welcome to the headquarters of the Last Minute Heroes. You may have heard of us always there to save the day at the very last minute. Our headquarters are free to enter the public, just don't cause any trouble. Whoa. Hexacast, the self-proclaimed coding wizard, lead strategist of the guild, chaser of the most effective approach, always finds a way to victory even if it takes minor sacrifices. Sorry, no entrance into the building for the public at the moment. Interior is still being renovated. Should be finished soon, though. Huh. The game's really starting to get into full swing now. We're gonna join a guild. We're gonna do our first dungeon, eh? All these are locked. I wonder if they unlock as time goes on. Thank you. 